Yo, what is going on guys? This is the third episode of the Deka Street. These games will not be live because I got a new microphone and I decided instead of having the first two games live, which they were in the third game randomly not, this is not going to be a live commentary one, but hopefully you guys still enjoy it. I want your feedback in terms of what you want to see from the series because I feel like right now it just doesn't have enough. Three games, uh, three wins and a pack and that's about it. So I want to know what you guys want to see. This first game we played, I was like, eh, maybe we could try to change it up and uh, do something different. So that game was an 8 nothing blowout win. He had nothing going. I feel bad for him. He probably just started playing the game. He had nothing at all. I think he had like 4 shots to my 29 or 31. We move into this game and we go up one nothing early on in this. And again guys, I'd love to see some feedback or comments telling me what you want to see for the Deka Street, what I can improve on it. This game we're up one nothing. We're trying to get our second win. He gets a penalty shot and we make a lucky save. I'm not good at the goalie, especially on penalty shots. I don't even know what I was doing. I luckily got the save here, he gets a power play midway through the second, and you know, dink in the net. Not a good PK for me, he wins the faceoff, that's the main point for me, I can't win faceoffs, even the game I won 8 nothing last game, I think I only had like 4 or 5 more faceoff wins. And with 22 seconds left, he's not going to score to tie the, tie the game, wait, he tied the game with 21 seconds. Even after getting parts of people, our team just, it's still not quick enough. It's pretty good, but it's not quick enough. This game went to overtime, but we quickly managed to squeak out of that and get a win. Murray is 8-1. You saw that there. The one loss was against a way overpowered team. And then this Buffalo guy, he gets a quick goal. A lot of the goals are coming from the same way on Murray. Again, I don't blame Murray. It's just the type of shots that go in. Again, my goals, a lot of mine are coming in the backhand from like partial breakaways. And then there's just that, like so much BS has been going on our goalie. <laughs> Alright everybody. Our team knows what to do with 10 minutes left. We want to get this second win here so that we only need one more so that we can open a pack and hopefully get a decent player in the pack or whoever we get on the page. And So again guys, I want to know what you want to see. We tie the game with 9 minutes left. What you want to see for the next series of episodes. And then there's the game winning goal by Dylan Larkin who's been a huge, huge player for us. He's our best player. And we win this game as well as we win the Division 9 title. Wasn't that hard. I don't. I think we got one loss. I'm not sure what we got. Our record now is nine and one, so that means we got three wins equals one pack. And at the moment, the World Cup of Hockey pack was out, so I'm like, why not open one of these? So we ended up opening just one of these, obviously, and then we're gonna pick the best player, or we don't have to pick the best player, but we pick the player that we want to join the team, and then we go from if he's an 88 overall, we go eight pages, and then the eighth one over. So the first guy we get is Anisimov, which I'm like, he's a good guy. Is there anything better? And then we get Atkinson, and I'm like, wow, his stats are really good. And he's a right wing who's going to help our speedy wingers go there. So we decided to pick Atkinson, and then we move into the eighth page, the sixth guy there, because Atkinson is 86 overall. You guys know the rules, but we want to expand on that, so please leave a comment, honestly. And if not, you could DM me on Twitter if you want to talk about something that you can improve. But we get Phil Kessel, 87 overall. In my opinion, probably the best 87 in this game forward-wise or the best that I actually want on this team. But Phil Kessel, welcome to the Deka Street. Like you, be strong To hold the powers of the sun To dream in me And strength now I'm the only one Only one
Who said?